Hello and welcome to Beads Jar. My name's Billy and today I'd like to show you how to set these beautiful black diamond Rivoli earrings. Um, we have used the lever back as well so they stay in your ears a lot better. To set these beautiful Swarovski Rivolis we're going to use the lever back Rivoli earrings, so they're really fab. I've just got this beautiful little lever on, and we'll be using some pink tack. Obviously, you can use blue tack, and we've got some Fevy Quick and some tweezers to help us with this. So, I've secured the pink tack onto my desk so it's not moving, and then I'm also going to use the lever backs, and I want the back of those, and I'm going to push that into the pink tack here. And then we're going to do the same and I'm just going to reverse that that way. We just don't want them to be able to move about. So they're nicely positioned and ready for the glue. Now before you move on to the glue section I'd recommend that you take the first crystal in the tweezers so you're ready to go with that because it sets pretty quick this stuff. Now you don't need to use excessive amounts, really really don't with this, it's very strong and if you use too much, it splurges over the edges and gives you an unpleasant effect when it's finished. So I'm just going to take the cap off and you probably want a pin-sized drop at the bottom of the Rivoli setting because it'll spread out quite a lot. So I've put my glue in place and then you can use your tweezers to take the crystal just going to drop that and then if you need to you can position it to the exact spot you want and it's just amazing the sparkle on these crystals is unbelievable obviously that's positioned well so as the glue sets it's not going to move about so I'm just going to do the other one there's a bit of a tilt on there and again applying the glue just a small amount, no need to go excessive with that glue. And I'm going to take the crystal and drop it in first, and then you can position that correctly within the Rivoli setting. Just going to push that down a fraction until I'm happy with it. Now the glue should take about 10 minutes to set fully, so just leave it there while you go and enjoy a nice cup of tea and a biscuit. Thank you for watching and I hope you've enjoyed this short demonstration with us. Um, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel, give us any feedback and a thumbs up and we look forward to seeing you next time. Bye!